Yo ho guys, what up and welcome back to another one. Today we're doing some dog training. We brought old Fred out here to Wade's house to do some training with Storm. Storm, our little black girl here, this is Wade's girl. She is awesome. A lot of you guys seen her on the last season of a ton of hunts. She was there for a lot of filled goose hunts, weren't you girl? Long story short, if you haven't seen Storm in action, she's amazing. I mean, amazing. And then we got old Fred here. He's ready to go. Made him a new partner today. You meet Storm for the first time, buddy. Yeah. You also jumped in their pool. Mm-hmm. But these two little critters here are going to be partners when it comes hunting season. Fred don't even know it yet. But this is what we're doing today. Check it out. We are using the dummy launcher. This is our dummy. And this right here is the launcher. A lot of you have probably used these and seen these before. Uh, Wade actually has been using it for, I don't know, probably about a week. And it is pretty interesting. It takes these little like 22 cartridges. These are actually for uh, nail guns. You can buy them at Home Depot or wherever. Put that bad boy in there and it's loud and it launches the dummy for you. But a lot of you seen the last training video of Frez and it was introducing him to gunshot in particular. And uh, I learned a lot. I learned a bunch from that video. But I learned a lot more from you guys. You guys dropping your tips down in the comment section below was incredible, seriously. And the people that actually went way out of their way and hit me up on Instagram and shot me a DM, seriously, thank you guys so much. Have learned a ton. Oh yeah. Heading out back to the pond is what we're doing. You guys ready back there? Oh, like the new kennels? Old Wade found them for a discount price. Big shout out to old Charlie. Thank you, man. Check out the old unit. Wade's got an absolute unit going on. We used this bad boy last year for the first time and we need a rack on it. We need a big old rack to hang the floater ducks off of. We need built in shotgun holders to go back here. We need the whole deal. So if any of you guys know, Anybody that wants to hook up the channel with some sweet duck racks right here, get a hold of me. Send me an email. Well, watch old Storm here. She's an absolute unit. She's a little girl. I mean, she is a little girl. No, set. Set. No bird. Here. Go. She is a unit. She's a little bitty girl. But man, let me tell you what. I've never seen another dog outrun her <laughs> for a hundred yard retrieve on a goose. She is accurate. She's nimble. Fast little girl right there. What do you think, Fred? You big footed galoot, huh? You gonna learn from her? You gonna learn a thing or two, huh? Mark. No bird. Stolen. Old Frederick here. He's getting Nancy all in his pantsy. We're gonna get him freshened up in the water. Come on, I'm trying to get him to stay. Stay is the name of the game. And a lot of you guys on the last video, you said, Bob, you have to get yourself a shot collar. I know, that's the next step. Stay. Sit. Fred. He's gonna get them long legs going for that one. Good, here. A lot of you guys also said um, to clap real loud. Like when he's around, just clap in his ear. A lot of you said it would help get him uh, used to gunfire. So, so if you guys have any more helpful tips on how to get him used to gunfire, that's what we're doing today. But if there's something I don't know, let me know down below. Here, come on. Oh, are you tired already, you gump? What's wrong, dude? Oh, did Storm show you up already? Heel, Fred, no. Here. Heel. Being a little lazy. Stay. Fred. Didn't go around it. That's good. Good. Here. Here. Run, dude. Come here, Gump. Good. 
Good. Heel. 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 Good. Ready? Stay. Fred. Just got to get some obedience in them. That's all. But that's what we're doing today. Today is a dog training day, and today is the first day, like I said, that we have Storm and Fred together. They are going to be buddies. They are going to be hunting partners out of an A-frame, out of layouts. When me and Wade are laying in white or anything, these two are going to be partners. But watch how Storm hits the water. She is an absolute unit. I mean, she is just a unit. Watch how she hits the water here. <laughs> she is fast. Goodness. <laughs> Stop. Absolute unit. <laughs> Thanks, girl. What you think, dude? You want to get to be that fast, huh? Well, here's the old dummy launcher. Wade said he put a new O-ring, that one right there, and says it's extra, extra loud. Hopefully old Fred here, hopefully he won't mind it today. But we're gonna use it on Storm first. Uh, we're gonna show you guys, and I, we're gonna show you how it works. I've never got to actually see it work. We're gonna keep Fred in the kennel. We're gonna go about 20 yards over yonder and let him just hear it from a distance first. You're good. Here she goes, here. Mark. Oh Ow. my god. <laughs> yep, look, she's like, oh dad, really? You gotta put it on me? Yep. <laughs> Wait, he's like, well, she broke one time, it ain't gonna happen again. Mark. Oh man. Man, that launches it far, dude. I bet you it launches it an easy 100, easy 100 yards, 80 yards. Easy 80 yards every time. Depends on the pitch of it. I'm sure you can get it out there probably Good 120 girl. yards, 110 yards. Heel. Heel. But we're gonna film Fred here on the next pop, see how he uh, mines it. Nope, didn't mind it at all. Good. Giving her a good old loading here. Oh yeah. Alrighty, well this is the last launch for Storm before we put Fred up to the test Mark. over the water. Oh yeah. Storm. Good looking girl you are. All right, come on, big boy. Let's go. Come on. Your turn. So our idea, our game plan is, is that me and Fred, Fred here, we're going to go about, I don't know, 30 yards this way, and I'm going to hold Fred. He's going to stay at heel, and Wade is going to be over there with the launcher about 30, 35 yards away. Fred. Oh, heck yeah. Good. Good. Here. Good, here, here, Fred, here. He's like, oh, he don't know whether to take it back to you or me. That's the problem. You want to take it back to Wade? Okay. <laughs> he actually understood where it came from, and he wanted to take it back to Wade. Okay, that works. At least this shot didn't scare him, and he retrieved it. We're good. Let me just launch it right in front of him. Yeah, just stand, yeah, 10 yards. We'll see how he does here. Stay, Fred. Fred. Heck yeah. Good here. That's a good boy. Yeah. That's a good boy, Frederick. You want a fun one? You want it? You want it? You want it? Go get him. Good here. Here. All right. He's spicy now. Here we go. Well, we just did a bunch of them, and he is doing great. He's loving it, actually. Here, Fred, he'll stay. 
stay, Fred. So we're going to stand right side by side here and basically shoot over him. See how he does. Fred. Oh, nah, that was my fault. He still don't mind it. Good boy. I let him break. I usually hold his ear a little harder than that. Here. All right, we're going to try her one more time. I don't want him breaking this time, basically. We're good to go. Set, set. Fred, set. No. No. Fred. There we go. Good. Here. No. Yeah. Good boy, dude. That's a good boy. Fred. Dead bird. Good. Good boy. Here. Well, there we go. He's doing awesome. Well, we are done for today's training session. That's all she wrote. Poor Frederick, he hurt his paw the other day. We were working water down at the river and he got a puncture wound right in the middle of two pads. Just, it looked like a stick that punctured real deep. Poor dude, so we haven't got to do any work in the water lately. Yesterday was actually the first day that I threw the dummy for him. Probably let him sit for four days. He was, uh, he was limping real bad. His paw was real swollen. But yeah, his paw is finally healing up. I was able to throw the dummy for him a little bit yesterday. He didn't limp on it much, but I can tell it's swollen up just a little bit from him running on it like that. So, so we're gonna have to give him some more time. But the old pigeons, they are a chilling in there. And I can't show you, we might have a new one in there that I possibly trapped. You can't see yet. That'll be on a video to come. But I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. You guys have been giving me a ton of tips down in the comment section below. Bobby, hey, you need to do this with Fred. You need to do that with Fred. And believe me, it has helped a ton. But honestly, thank you guys for being here. Without you guys, we couldn't be out here doing this and we couldn't be training Fred near as good, I can tell you. I was a dummy walking into the whole dog training deal. I didn't know anything hardly. But if you like these dog training videos, you have to smash that thumbs up for your boy. And if you have any video suggestions over dog training that you want me to do, you know what to do. Drop them down in the comment section down below. But again, thank you all for being here. If you haven't subscribed, you need to do so because we're coming at you guys with videos every single day. But until next time, peace.